The state men's basketball team coming off a victory in the CCA tournament. They were the number five seed and defeated the number four seed. Cal Poly Humboldt, 73 to 57. I'm joined today by head coach Rich Shawitz in the middle. On his right, we have Nick Klarman, and on his left, Jalen Wells. Coach, just take me through your thoughts and what went on there out there today. Uh, first off, just want to give credit to a great Humboldt team, super talented. Uh, like Coach uh, had said in his press conference, uh, he was trying to speed the game up and I thought uh, it was going to be a battle of tempo and I thought uh, they played a great game and they got some really good players and, and I, hats off to them for having a great year and uh, really happy about our group who was able to control the tempo in the second half. I thought in the first half we did just enough. We had missed some layups. We missed a couple uh, easy plays that I thought could have gave us the lead in the first half. But in the second half, we buckled down, controlled the tempo, really, really played great defense and rebounded, rebounded the heck out of the ball. Really happy for these guys. You talk about tempo out there. What was the plan, without giving too much away, to slow that tempo out there? Um, I don't think it's really changing anything that we've really done. Uh, we stick to our principles and we play our brand of basketball and make sure that we don't get sped up by them. Um, we, we always just rely a lot on our ball handlers to break those press that they threw at us and I think we did a great job of limiting the turnovers tonight. The other part when I look at tempo, and to me what was the difference in the game, you guys outscored them by 19 points at the free throw line. Hard to have a fast game, there's so many free throws. Jalen, you were the biggest part of that, went 13 of 14 at the free throw line. What was working today? How are you able to get to the free throw line so many times, both you and your teammates? Uh, it starts with uh, my teammates. I mean, they want the big body out there setting screens, so they got to help. So there's, there's no option. Uh, we get to the basket. Don't, I mean, we just like you said, he said um, the guards didn't, didn't uh, give in to the pressure. First roll of the day, you always write on the board. Sonoma doesn't beat Sonoma, so that's what we did today. Well, good quote. Nick, I want to hear just a little bit about you guys. I know that the season's not done. You guys have an opportunity to play tomorrow. Just how important is getting a CCA tournament win kind of for where you guys were gathering in October? This has to be kind of one of the goals. Yeah, it? man. It feels really good. I can't really describe how much, how all of us have worked so hard to get here. And um, I really appreciate all the guys, you know, buying into what we have here. And I think we have a really special group and we all play together so well. And I think it's just a luxury to have, to be able to be a part of such a good team. And, you know, let's just, Keep it rolling. Fantastic. Did you want to say something there, Coach? Yeah. Well, you mentioned you had a chance to keep it rolling. You guys do have the number one seed tomorrow. You guys played um, Cal State San Bernardino very tough last time. So we look forward to another game. See you back in the semifinals of the 2023 CCA Tournament on Friday at 2.30. Thank you. Thank you.